All right. Um, city council wants three wheelers, four wheelers, golf carts, blah, blah, blah. Off road vehicles to be allowed to drive on road. I can see a couple problems. Licensing. Who's going to enforce? Who's going to make sure that people actually do license them and not do what they currently do and just drive them? Uh, there's somebody in our neck of the woods over here. Likes going quite fast down our alleys all hours of the day and night. Loud exhaust. Um, at times, they'll want to do all these stunty things and kick up a lot of the dirt back there, right? Um, yeah, typical. Um, not 40-year-old behavior, you know? You're, uh, you know... Uh, Playing, having a good time, that's fine. But why can't you go drive your off-road vehicle down the Haney Road? Why do you have to be obnoxious in town on your ATV? Golf cart? Well, you know, stereotypes are stereotypes because a lot of them are true. Golf carts? You can be dealing with like 50-year-olds. And how much horsepower has a golf cart got? I don't know. I can guarantee you that the golf cart's probably going to be a lot quieter than these no muffler ATVs. Either way, I just don't like the idea of them on the road. Um, anything short of an insurance mandate, and even then, um, I did read something about uh, on-road vehicles have right-of-way. That's great, but what what for the ones that just go, it's legal! Let's go. They didn't read it. They don't know, you know. Um, and they they, they T-boned me. I got an old truck. It's like a 95. Now they T-bone my truck. Now that's going to incur me expenses. They ain't got no insurance. And, you know, let's face it. Uh, you know, maybe they ain't got nothing to go after to recover your money to fix your vehicle. I think it's just, I think it's another problem that we're going to have to deal with later because one of our council members wants to screw around on his ATV or his golf cart. It's, they're off-road vehicles for a reason. The state has laws not wanting them there for a reason. I, I don't go for big government, but this is kind of one of those deals where I think you're opening up a big can of worms.